Hey guys, it's Mr. Brian here. We're out um, in the Willamette National Forest today uh, doing some hiking up at a place called Gordon Meadows. And we are going to talk about a fun art activity that you guys could do wherever you are, in a park, in your backyard. Um, it's just a, a simple way to get creative with the things that you find outside. Indigo is ready to move on to whatever's next. So, so if you look here at this example, um, this one was created with a bunch of pine cones and little leaves and mosses. Um, so, so this is kind of what a finished product could look like. Um, now if we come over here, I can show you how we got set up for another project here. So if you see right here, we've made all these piles of different things we found out here in the forest. We've got some sticks, some some moss, some some leaves, some fir leaves. We've got some uh, cones of bigger cones and smaller cones. We've got some broken us broken up bear grass stalks and some rocks. And then right here we have a very special find that Indigo found. Some coyote poop seems to be a theme. And if you look really closely, you can actually see. I'm not touching it, but you can see the bones of whatever creature this coyote ate. You can see it right there, and there's some more over here. So that's kind of interesting. I wonder what kind of bones they are. But anyway, so what you can do is you can just make little piles of, of different items, and then you can just start decorating. Um, I'm going to use this coyote poop as our central piece here. So we can just start decorating however we want, okay. using whatever we want. Would you like to help Indigo? Here. All right. So then you just kind of use all the rest of your uh, your items, and you can get as creative as you want, and have fun with it, and place it so where where people can see it, so that they can enjoy it when they're walking on the forest too. So I hope you guys all have fun creating fun art projects next to trails or in parks, so other people can see. So have fun, and we'll talk to you soon.